Hundreds of people will get together soon to honor breast cancer survivors. And the woman who's organizing it all is an 11 year survivor herself. In this week's Doing Good Report, we look at how she's now helping others get the treatment they need. It's been quite the journey for Connie Williams. In the year 2008, I found a lump, did not tell anyone, didn't tell my husband, didn't tell anyone, went to the doctor. The test was positive. Williams had breast cancer. Chemo, radiation, um, had double mastectomy reconstruction. When she did tell her husband, she called this an opportunity, working through her treatments as a school counselor. Put out a, a notice to all my school. I kept working. Um, as a matter of fact, I started chemo, lost all my hair, just hair, but I was losing it, and I had a get naked with Connie party, and we shaved it off, and we put it on KNWA. A chance to model strength and courage, something she had seen plenty of through years of working with Komen Ozark. I would get wigs. I had a blonde wig. I had a red wig. I had a short one. I had a little longer one. So my students never knew what was going to show up. Now she's an 11-year survivor and still volunteering for Komen Ozark. And our survivors make some of our best volunteers because they've, they've been there, they know why we're doing what we're doing, and they're really passionate about why we're doing it. Williams is the chairwoman for the upcoming Pink Ribbon Luncheon, an event that raised $200,000 last year. It takes about $150 to get a mammogram. There are women that can't afford to get one. They can't afford transportation. They can't afford to leave their families to do it. 75% of um, what we raise stays here for local services. And then the other 25% goes to our national uh, research portfolio to fund cutting edge research. But the money isn't the only benefit. It's a chance for women to see strong survivors like Williams. It is a time for them to come, to be recognized, and to see other survivors. There's nothing like sitting next to a 20 year survivor to make you know that you're going to be okay. This year's Pink Ribbon Luncheon is on October 23rd. For information on how you can sign up, just head to our website, nwahomepage.com.